the way to Webster and now crossing north, Roslyn, if you're in Langford, Eden, and going all the way up to Britain and Sisseton and that Roberts County cell. I know that uh, you, Adam, have some new information about that particular part of the line. Yeah, up toward the Sisseton area, there is a new tornado warning. This is for uh, Roberts County as well as Northern Grant until 7 o'clock. This is moving north at 70 miles per hour with this line near Orly to Millbank. Again, north at Seven. 70 up toward the assistant area. Yep, that's the warning for the exact thing Brian was talking yep. about there. Yeah. Summit. It just came up. That feature. Here, pick it up. 70 mile hour straight line winds. Assistant in there at 643. So you've got a little bit of time, but not much. Get in your basement now as that segment is the strongest probably of the bunch, but anywhere along that line, we cannot rule out yep. a tornado spin up. That's the strongest circulation we have. No travel advisory throughout the town. Probably a good idea. Let the emergency responders handle their, uh, handle their jobs. In that same area, Carolina's Richard Bennett joins us now from the state of South Dakota, where there is also extensive damage. It's windy, but it's not blowing the birdhouse too badly right now. More rain coming through. Dear Lord, be with us. On the Minnesota side of the border, just a little bit southeast of Ortonville, uh, we'll continue to watch for that. So those are other indicators suggesting to us that we've had some very strong winds with these storms, and obviously that's been the story. Outside with my DJI getting some storm. We might have gotten very lucky, not sure. We're not out of the woods yet, but brought the plants in. Just where you expect them. Highways, areas north of Highway 14, Don, are under a tornado watch until 10 o'clock tonight. And if we can see why, we are definitely seeing some destructive weather going on in northeastern South Dakota. Viewers informed and keeping everyone safe. Thanks a lot. 7 o'clock. Some branches down. Nothing too major here, ladies and gentlemen. Some afterwind effects, but damage Madison, South Dakota, big time. I see a bigger branch down across the street, but came out okay here. Got a branch down, a little clog of water where it usually sits. Not horrible. Got a gar garbage can in the neighbor's backyard, but I'll get that later. Hopefully the building up here is uh, safe. Not sure if some things got taken out on that or not. Sure hope not. You guys are doing a great job here. Had the first of 13 grief share meetings at the Millbank Vid Visitor Center tonight with Mom. We basically said nothing, but what a great group of people. Wow. And got out of there, and it felt syrupy, thick. Tennis meat got just stopped, and the Sioux Falls Christian team headed home. And then not long after that came the wind, very dark in the south. Look at the water sitting out there. And the parking lot of the high school. Three days to go. Looks pretty clear. I mean, free of damage and busy, 